time for battle. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I'm your host, Daryl Spiller, here bringing you my first impressions of the newly leaked Mario plus Rabbids Kingdom Battle for the Nintendo Switch. So a couple weeks ago, I did a video on a news recap, and I explained about this so-called Mario plus Rabbids rumor that I honestly did not think was real by any means. But we got some images, and it is real. I mean, unless we got another artsy omni with Rayman, I mean, uh, it's it's real. I mean, look at these images. I'll put it around here, right here. Um, but yeah, Mario's got like the Mega Man theme going. He's got a Mega Arm Cannon, and uh, Luigi's got like a Poultry Gust. Yoshi's got like a Bazooka, and you got a rabbit doing a selfie. <sighs> What's next? Fidget spinner? I mean, he's got a yo-yo. It's gonna be a fidget spinner. You got a rabbit wearing a Yoshi, Yoshi, a Yoshi costume in the back, and you got the the Megaton hammer in the back. He, or yeah, hammer slash axe. I don't know what that is. And Peach has got a gun. And yeah, I mean, this looks like a new art style for the Mario characters as well. I think it looks unique. Now, a lot of people are freaking out about this. Or they're pro against it. The rabbits are like the minions. Well. I can see why you would think that, but I don't really see a problem with it. If it is a funny RPG, if this has unique elements, if it's a fun game, it doesn't really matter to me. We have some actual, like, concept box art. So this game is coming out very soon. It is codenamed RKB, and it is in the genre for Crazy Combat Adventure, and it is slated for an August-September-ish uh, release. So that is very, very soon, and it is obviously coming for the Nintendo Switch. That is really good. This is the first Mario RPG on the Switch, or on a home console for that matter. Um, but it is being made by Ubisoft. Ubisoft, don't, don't get mad for me mispronouncing the name. I'll just say Ubisoft. The story mode will be about 20 hours hours to complete that sounds very good as long as there's more content like enough content for me to keep coming for it and playing it okay and it will have two player local co-op which is really really cool and it will apparently have 35 percent exploration with a 65 percent turn-based combat which i really like the original Mario Luigi games for their combat, and especially Mario RPG on the uh, Super Nintendo. That was very, very unique. If they bring some of that back, I think this game could be really, really fun. So, it has four world environments, which that's where it starts concerning me. I mean, as long as the worlds change enough and it isn't the same bland, <sighs> you know, plain, snow, desert, and you control a uh, tutorial? Which sounds a lot like Tutorial, and I believe he's on the box art as well. It's like a little rabbit dude. Sounds pretty unique. I'd like to see more. Um, and it twists Mario's world with full of Easter eggs, which sounds very, very exciting. I like to see little things added and something different. Switching it up. And it has eight playable characters, unique characters, and uh, tactical options such as dash, team jumps, warp pipes, destructible covers, etc. So you can upgrade them and stuff. I mean, it's an RPG. Yeah, level them up and collect weapons. That sounds really cool too. For Mario, I mean, yeah, collect weapons. I'm wondering if you can collect like, um, I mean, this is a weapon, but I, whenever I think of weapons, I think like this, you know, weapons. <laughs> Anyway, uh, but like moves, moves. I could assume that's a weapon. Yeah, because you're using it against enemies. But there is a variety of combat objectives and events. And seven enemy arch types, one boss and mid boss per world. But yeah, overall this game looks pretty good. I can't wait to see more. At E3, there will be a reaction definitely to that event. That just about wraps up this video. If you like what you saw or heard, please be sure to hit that like button. Smash that subscribe button and ring that bell to stay up to date whenever I go live or upload a video. And as always, stay awesome, keep the hype alive, and I will see you guys in the next video.